Hi friends, welcome to our channel Be a Wise Investor. Please note, I am not a SEBI registered investment advisor. Contents of this video are for information purpose only. All investments are subject to market risk. If you are not understanding the risk or not ready to face the risk, please avoid stock market investment. We are very much thankful to you all who have shared, supported and subscribed our channel Be a Wise Investor. Please like, share and subscribe this channel. Friends, today I found two PSU stocks which are, seems to be priced much less and all chances are there that they may give a very good appreciation in the coming days. The stocks are, the first one is Bank of Maharashtra. Current market price is 67 rupees 65 paisa. The company was founded on 16th September 1935 and is headquartered in Pune. It is a PSU bank with the Government of India holding 86.46 percentage. Board of the bank recently approved to raise rupees 7,500 crores via follow on public offer and others. Also, bank should increase the public holding to 25 percentage from the present level of 13.54 as per the SEBI listing norms. It is expected that it may announce the FPO offer at any time and expect the price to move further. On 26th, bank came with the quarterly fourth quarter results and annual result. Its total business increased by 15.94 percentage year on year to 4,74,411 crores and it will cross 5 lakh crores before first quarter of 2425. Its advances also increased by 16.30 percentage year on year to 2,3664 crores. Its credit deposit ratio improved to 75.22 percentage. It is really much better. Provision coverage ratio is 98.34. It is very huge on the industry level. Net income, net interest income also increased by 26.88 percentage to 9,822 crores. Its gross NPA declined to much lower level of 1.88 percentage, whereas net NPA is just 0 0.20 percentage only. Operating profit also increased by 31.25 percentage to rupees 8,005 crores, whereas net profit increased by 55.84 percentage to 4,025 crores. It reported an EPS of 5.80 as against an EPS of 3.87 last year. Return of assets also improved to 1.73 percentage as against last year's 1.10 percentage. Return on equity also improved to 23.83 percentage as against 20.38 percentage last year. Cost to income ratio also improved to 37.55 percentage as against 39.14 percentage last year. Casa increased to 1,42,774 crores from the earlier level of 1,24,961 crores. It gives a low cost in a <coughs> fund to the bank, which will in turn give you a very good income in the coming days. Credit as a capital adequacy ratio also improved to 17.38 percentage. Retail, Agri and MSME business grew by 24.21 percentage on year on year basis. Board has announced a dividend of 1.40 per share that is 14 percentage as against last year's 13 percentage per 13 percent that is 1.30 per share. Fee based income also increased 20.86 percentage on year on year basis to 1582 crores. The chart is on the daily chart it is showing on the up move and it may cross 70 at any time where after closing basis if it cross 70 then it may immediately touch 82 and then 95 and even beyond 100 also current market price of the share is 67.65 market capital is 47,884 crores face value of the share is rupees 10 and book value 26.02 52 week high is 70 and 52 low is 26.80. Trailing 12 month EPS is 5.75. Price 
price earnings ratio is 11.8 as against the industry PE of 10.40. Return on capital employed 5.77 percentage, whereas return on equity is 25.80. Debt equity ratio is 15.50. Last year it paid a dividend of <coughs> the last latest dividend announced is 14 percentage. Last year it announced the dividend of 13 percentage. 50-day moving average is 61 and 200-day moving average is 49.80. At present, it is trading above 50 day as well as 200 day moving average. Promoter holding, that is, Government of India is holding, is 86.5 percentage. No pledge is there. FIS increased their holding to 1.04 percentage from the last year's level of 0.26 percentage. 33 mutual fund schemes are having this stock in their portfolio. The second stock is Indian Energy Exchange Limited. Current market price is 158.85. The company was founded on 26th March 2007 and is headquartered in Noida. It engages in the power exchange business and provides an automated platform for trading, electricity and related products. It enables trading and price discovery of electricity and related products with the risk management of participants of the electricity markets. The firm's products include day ahead market electricity contracts, term ahead market electricity contracts, Renewable energy certificates and energy saving certificates. It came out with an IPO at the rate of 1650 per share with a face value of rupees 10 each on 23rd October 2017. Later, it was split into face value of 1 each in 2018 and issued bonus shares in the ratio of 2 is 1 in 2021. That means 100 shares applied or 10 shares applied in the IPO 2017 may have now 300 shares in their hands. FIS are having a holding of 27.07% in March 2022 and now in March 2024 they increase their, <coughs> they decrease their holding it is just 10.89% whereas DA is holding increase from 19.48% to 27. 26 percentage in the same period. It has 7,600 plus registered participants including 60 plus distribution companies, 700 plus electricity generators and 4,800 plus open across consumers. Indian Energy Exchange commands an overall market share of 94.2 percentage and its market share is 99.9 percentage in DAM and RTO. Its revenue split is DAM 48 percentage, Green Energy 3 percentage, RTM 28 percentage, TAM 14 percentage, Certificates 7 percentage, Standalone Breakup is, Transaction Fees 78 percentage, Admission and Annual Fees 4 percentage, Other Income 18 percentage. <coughs> IGX Investors, this is Indian Energy, sorry, Gas Exchange Investors include NSC 26 percentage, Gail 5 percentage, ONGC 5%, Torrent Gas 5%, Adani Total Gas Limited 5% and Indian Oil Corporation 5%. Daily chart of this company also shows a very good positive mood and it crossed the level of 150, 157 also. Hence, it may cross at any time the all time high, sorry, the 52 high of 173 and it may cross 200 at any time also. The current market price of the share is 158.85. Market capitalization 14,515 crores. Face value is rupees 1, book value 10.78. 52 week high 173 and 52 week low is 116. Trailing 12 month EPS is 3.84. Price earning ratio is 41.33. Industry PE is 27.17. Return on capital employed 51.80 percentage and return on equity is 39.40 percentage. Debt equity ratio is 0.01. That means it is almost debt free. 50 day moving average is 146 and 200 day moving average is 144. At present, it is day, uh, quoting above 50 day as well as 200 day moving averages. FI is holding 10.89 percentage, DA is holding 27.24 percentage. As many as 65 mutual fund schemes are having this stock in their portfolio. SBI Arbitrage Opportunities Fund is holding around 6.68 percentage of the shares in their portfolio.
these all are the information available with me now for sharing thank you so much for watching this video if you find this useful please like the video share it with your friends and relatives and subscribe the video please